Hey, so I'm coming to you from Woodburn, Oregon, and this home behind me that you're getting a little sneak peek of is the Maxburg. We're gonna take a look at it just in a moment here. If you haven't visited this channel before, know that we tour homes, manufactured homes, and modular homes throughout the US, so make sure you hit the subscribe button so you're notified anytime a new video is released. All right, let's go ahead and check this one out. Okay, so let's go ahead and walk into the Maxburg. Ta-da! What do we have here? I'm just taking my shoes off because they were squeaking. Look at this, open space. Wow, this is nice. Nice open kitchen. living room area oh and the heater just kicked in it works <laughs> so nice living area and look at these windows wow it's great all right let's go ahead and get into this take a quick peek at this home so here you have a round table and you have that added window there for some natural light here is the kitchen you have a nice sized island, their counter height, and there are two chairs here. I would keep it this way. I probably would not try to squeeze in three with the amount of space that's here. This is narrow, but functional. It's the perfect, you know, it's a great size to just lean on over and do what you need to do. Um, nice amount of cabinets located below. Let's take a look here. So they are deep and they do go all the way through to where what would be the equivalent of the end of the seat um, on that side. So nice deep cabinets and you do have drawers and it looks like it goes from the narrow down to the, the larger ones. There, let me just open that. Deeper, I should say, not larger. So you have some cabinets up above and there is here appears to be like freezer on top and um, refrigerator on the bottom nice set of organizing to start off and then here is the freezer it's your regular freezer A nice amount of cabinet space here so we're looking at about 800 square feet so this one here two bedroom one bath um, look at this kitchen size you do have nice amount of cabinets look at this sink oh so so nice oh and I like this handle here and I believe they call this here like a maple or sugar cane finish something like that and then these guys here deep on the bottom and then normal size at the top nice whirlpool appliances so you have your stove electric range and you have your timers and setters here so it looks like oh you have a warmer you can keep your food warm that's cool Okay, and then here we have your microwave. Okay, so let's go ahead and continue. Here we have bathroom. And like I said, this is a two bedroom, one bath. So this is the shared bathroom for the household. So a nice wide bathroom, nice mirror with the frame and a medicine cabinet. Let's take a look at these drawers. And the cabinet space underneath. And let's go ahead and take a look here. So this is the primary room. And here is the closet. It's a pretty good size closet. 
And there's like a queen size bed, great amount of space. I mean, this could be instead of what it is right here, you could just put a dresser here. Again, a tall chest would work, nightstands. Um, so plenty of room here to make this a comfortable primary room. Okay, and let's take a look here. So this is the secondary bedroom. So this one here, I would say it would need to be a twin sized bed, um, more like a kid's room or an office space would be quite difficult, I think, to get a full size. You could get a full size and then there'd be nothing else in here, I don't think, uh, with space. And here's the closet. Still pane windows. Oh, and did you hear the heating went off? So this is what it sounds like with the door closed. And let's make our way to the laundry. And what I mean by this is what it sounds like. It's, it's quiet. <laughs> Don't hear much in here. So here's the laundry, washer, dryer, and then you have some storage space. If you have pets, this could also be like a great feeding station for your dog. Um, I would probably use this space for that. I have my little, little gal eat there comfortably. And I'm just panning back to the kitchen area so you can take another quick peek at this kitchen. All right, so there you have it. We've just taken a peek at the Maxburg here um, by Fleetwood. Again, it's a two bedroom, one bath, just shy of 800 square feet. And I hope you got to see the great use that they used, um, the great way that they maximized the amount of space utilized with the square footage. So great job here. Um, if you have any questions, just make sure that you drop them down below. We do check them and we'll be happy to answer them. We're also including links to the floor plan, the sales office and the website down below. So you can go ahead and check that out and get more information and get a full list of the features and benefits. I'm Chiselle with ManufacturedHomes.com. Until next time, bye.